So that's me trying not to make noise for the neighbors. But we woke up very early by three we're up, you know, to get ready and set out to Zoroti Tesolan. But unfortunately I was just not coming back home to celebrate the festive season, but I was also told my auntie, my mom's sister had passed on and that was so heavy on me. And the, that very day we're traveling was the very day she was going to get married so we had to really rush to make sure we're on time for the burial and um, i really didn't know how to handle this news but i just give god the glory for everything so we reached quite early and i thank god Cody was buried and i didn't make a video of that because it was too much for me but then we came back and slept at this place called Rhino Camp. And then the next morning we had to head back to the village for a clan meeting, which I went with my sister, my auntie, some of our relatives. And so glad my husband joined me for the first time. And the meeting, you know, clan meetings, you are like serious meetings. A lot is talked about, but we got done and then definitely had to get ready to come back to my husband's village because we had um traditional marriage between my sister-in-law and my brother and it was a big deal for me but with everything that happened still i had to you know refocus my mind on this function too and that's happy trying to wake me up because i was really beaten up i was really so tired but then there was a big day and I was so excited about it. I made it all things. I made this, the storms. I was so glad that these two people were getting married. Two people that I love so much and I thank God for. So I was getting ready to be a daughter-in-law and just play my part. And this is how it started. This was the deco and yeah. The operations are ongoing. The operation was green and uh, gold. That's what Mongoli wanted, and yeah, it looked beautiful. Hi, baby. Making sure. Hi. What's the new You want to be on YouTube? You want to be on YouTube? You wanna be international? Yeah. Good. Hey, today the cameraman. Yeah. And you have to do for us, man. So I'm willing to shake, man. <laughs> Everything I want. Edwin. <laughs> So guys, uh, this is uh, it's called Esther's Day. Today is Esther's Day, you know, she's going away from home. She's, she's, she's going for marriage. She's going to stay with her husband, I would say. So, we chopped the whole bull for this stuff. And this is what we have. This is called after party meat. It's for tomorrow, it is for roasting, so we shall be having a bull ballot. <laughs> Papa is telling me stop, stop hiding, come out. 
I saw him on the way. congratulations to my brother so all i can tell you guys is i remember my brother supporting me during my marriage and stepping this ground as my brother but now he's back as a son-in-law to take the love of his life 
how God does his things, that is God. But I am so happy for the two of them. They make the best couple. And I wish you, Essie and Joseph, the best in your marriage. May God continue to do amazing things and amaze you guys. I wish you all the best. May God continue to walk with you in this marriage. So our video comes to an end. Emalata, yes, Papa Emalata. Guys, yesterday was a vibe. Yo, today is a day after my sister in law's traditional marriage. And she was getting married to none other than my brother. That is a story for another day because, yo, the way God does the things, I don't know. But, yeah, I'm so excited. Uh, so we traveled. If you watch the video, I traveled. But sadly enough, the day I was traveling was the very day you know my auntie was getting married because i was told the, the day before that my auntie passed on and then i had to travel and yeah it was very sad i i, I can't even explain to you guys the weight at which i felt so bad like I, I i i can't this is like my mom is not the only you know daughter to my grandmother remaining but I thank God for everything that has happened, the good and the bad. But also yesterday brought joy and I couldn't even vlog, you know, the whole function because I was running around, I had a lot of work to do. But thank you so much guys for watching this video and I'm going to keep vlogging since I'm in the village, you know, share, you know, my life story with you guys, document it and let's be together i hope you're enjoying and uh this festive season has come with its own good and bad i'm just going to remain positive but above all we are grateful the year is coming to an end and that's all i wish for everyone to cross over you know happy excited about it but yeah here in the village the only thing i can tell you is it is hot if you are from the eastern you're from eastern uganda i don't know about you guys because me i am heating up i'm really feel like removing my hair because the heat is a lot but anyway we just handle it but guys i love you thank you for watching and sticking around and i'll see you guys in the next video ciao i love you with the love of god be blessed Whew. Yo, oh, village is making me so villagey, getting dark every day.